A lot has happened in the last few months. I haven't obviously posted a new video in a few months and I um, already posted on Instagram of everything that happened, but in this last August of 2023, uh, Jake and I found out we were pregnant again, and um, I unfortunately had another miscarriage and lost that baby on October 30th, and um, it sucks. There's no, there's not really a lot to say about it other than uh, we're just devastated and heartbroken. And it's really challenging to talk about. Um, and it, it just, it just sucks. It really does. I completely deleted like all social media and everything for two months and started doing a lot of pottery and art and just um, being with my friends and my family, like close friends and just saying like, I just want to enjoy life again. This last year has been so hard with like loss after loss after loss and other things happening as well that I was just like, I just want to focus on like being happy again not even happy, but just enjoying my life and finding those avenues of joy with the people I love. So that's what I've been really focusing on and doing a lot better. I was so incredibly angry at God, specifically so angry, and I haven't been able to talk about it for a long time until now because I feel like it's I've had enough time and been like sitting with it and praying and um, after my first loss all I could listen to was worship music and after this loss I'm like so angry at God I'm like I I just can't I can't I can't do anything because I feel like like I'm screaming at God saying why did you do this to me again I told you I couldn't handle this I told you like I couldn't go through it again um, but here I am and I'm getting through it a day at a time. He doesn't promise us a comfortable or easy life, that's for sure. Um, he promises suffering and I'm, I'm in it. <laughs> Even in my anger and frustration and wondering why and all, having a zillion different questions in my head, God keeps like gently nudging me towards the direction of trusting him no matter what the circumstance and surrendering to his plan not my own so that's where i'm at right now every day um trying to surrender to his plan what he has for jacob and i and our family and i don't know what he's doing but i'm going to choose to continue to trust him and his plan because what else am i going to do and in doing that that's where i find that's where I find real peace and that's where I find myself being okay with just moving forward and feeling this ease of, okay, I can, like, I'm really weak, but God is really strong and he's, he's holding us up for sure, <laughs> for sure, especially right now. So, um, we'll be okay. And if you're going through some, this is where I get choked up, if you're going through something similar, like in a season of waiting or a season of loss. I'm so sorry. It is just the worst thing in the world. It's so hard and deeply painful. And it just breaks my heart to know that there's so many, there's so many women out there who are going through similar um, circumstances. And I just can't believe how like common it is. It, it breaks my heart so know that um, you're seen <laughs> you're not alone and um, God hates it too he's he's not happy about it he hates death more than anything and um, he's mourning with us 
So that's why I feel like I can trust him with my future because he's the only one who really gets it, who knows, who sees every one of my tears and hears me crying out to him daily. <laughs> but run to him in any capacity you can. Again, my first loss, all I could do was listen to worship music. This time around, I'm uh, reading a lot and journaling a lot and praying a lot and that's helped most. We'll be okay. With all that said, that's where I've been. That's what's going on. And what's helped me the most is having a creative outlet. Like I've been taking up pottery a lot and I've been cooking a lot and baking a lot. And it's the one thing doing creative things that just gets me out of my own head. And so making these videos, getting back to the fresh pursuit really brings me a lot of joy and it's a creative outlet for me. So she's back, baby. It feels good to be back. So I'll see you in the next video, coming soon. Like and comment what you guys want to see more of, especially into this year. I have so many ideas and so many fun plans and projects coming up, but let me know what you wanna see more of or um, learn more of your favorite videos. Bye.